So here in this third movie that I've recorded to do with process version 2012 localized adjustments in camera raw 7, let's now look at making white balance adjustments locally. And in this instance, I'm going to use the graduated filter tool to apply the adjustment. Now with the image that we see here, I already made adjustments to the tone controls and to the white balance, and I quite like the color temperature that are on the castle in this photograph, but it would be nice if the sky could be perhaps a little bit bluer. So what I'm going to do here to begin with is to apply a negative temperature adjustment. So if I take this down to minus 50 and then just click and drag to apply the adjustment to the image. And that does actually add quite a nice shade of blue to the top half of the photograph. If I want to, I can then edit the temperature setting by making it not quite so cool. Of course, I could even go the other way and make it even warmer if I wanted to. But I quite like the adjustment as it is there. So I'll set it to around about the same the same position again. And then if I want to add a, another uh, adjustment to the bottom half of the picture, I can do the same thing. I can click and drag again. And I can apply a more blue down to the bottom half of the photo into the water. And here I can perhaps adjust the temperature to maybe make it a little bit cooler. And there's also a tint slider. So if I wanted to, I could make the color have more of a magenta tint to it or more of a green tint. And I think in this instance, it might be quite nice just to add a slight touch of green there to the photograph. So there you have it, a very short demo showing you how you can use the color temperature adjustments in this instance applied using the graduated filter tool. Uh, of course, you can also use the um, adjustment brush as well to apply these adjustments. Thank you.